Hello, my name is Yes. Today I read the Bible. The Bible title is this. Ruth for Naomi. I read. I'm going to. I'm going home. Say Naomi. Naomi moved the world to Moab with her husband and her two sons. A long time ago, there was big famine. In her hometown, Bethlehem, Naomi became old. Her husband and two sons died. Naomi was living with her daughter in the. I am going back to my people, said Naomi. I am going with you. I will go wherever you go. You home it will be my home, you God will be my God, say Ruth, the second daughter-in-law, Ruth became Bethlehem with Naomi, Ruth had to prepare food for Naomi, it was the harvest time in Bethlehem. Ruth gathered grain on the best fruit and eat with Naomi. Watch one the land. She takes good care of her mother in law. Ruth must be a good woman to watch. Ruth got grain. Dignity, but help root gutter. More grains. He help root it with other workers comfortably. Boaz was kind, rich man. Naomi said, Root, the Israel Tabron, window. Or you marry and closest with this was his closest baby and he like you. What don't you marry him? As for Naomi said was and Ruth got married. God gives Ruth a very special gift the baby baby boy Ubed. Grandma Naomi and Roots, we are very happy. God bless the roots. Yes, now we read this story. Girls met Samuel. Hannah was crying and praying in the temple. She didn't have any children. Her husband, Arkana, was a love, loving husband. The Agatha, or the wife, Pina, was girl to Hannah. Help me, God, give me a child. If you let me have the baby, I will offer him to you. The priest of Temple Ali. Other Hannah was wrong. Hannah, you have quite working. Hannah said to Ale, I'm not wrong. I am praying because I am so sad. The priest said to Hannah, God in peace. God will answer your prayer. Hannah was not sad anymore. God really gave her a son. Hannah was happy. She named him Samuel. Samuel means God answered my prayer. 
When Samuel was a little boy, Anna took Samuel to temple. I will give this child to God. Can you help him to serve God? Yes, I will help him, said Ellie, the priest. Hannah thanked God to Samuel. Samuel lived in his temple. He helped Ellie and served God. Samuel obeyed God. He made God happy. He made people happy. Hannah and Anna came to temple to worship God. Hannah brought a jacket for Samuel. They want Ali to bless them. Bless us with more child. Ali played for them. God blessed Anna with three sons and two daughters. Samuel served God in temple. He heard the voice of calling him. Samuel, Samuel. God calling Samuel. God spoke to Samuel. Every God said happening. Samuel gave message to people of Israel. He was patient prophet of God. Now I read this story. David's brave boy. I read. Come on out, say Goliath, the giant. Now come on out, fight with me. The Israel were fighting. The prison Goliath was a strongest prison soldier. King Saul and the Israel soldier were scared. I will fight with Goliath, said David. David brought food to to his brothers. <laughs> they were they were soldier of King Saul's army. David was mad because Goliath was making fun of God's army. You are a young boy. Korea is giant soldier, said King Saul. I will protect sheep from the lion and bear. God will be with me. King Saul gave her armor to David, but it was so big and heavy. The rear David stood before Goliath. He had stone and sling in his hand. Goliath was upset to see young boy David stone and sling. Do you think I am puppy? I came before you on name of Lord. You made the fun of God's army, didn't you? Didn't you? I will let the world let know that God is alive. God doesn't need sword and spear, said David. David put stone in his fling. He let the stone fly. The stone hit Goliath's forehead and he fell to the ground. David ran to Goliath. Uriot and took his sword. David won! Yes, today we read the Bible next time. Oh, there is more page. You are very brave, David, said King Saul. David was very brave. Everybody see David was brave. And, but David now God helped him. Yes, today we read the Bible for fun and the fun. Yes, I fun. Yes, see you next time. Bye!